What's going on GW Nation? This is Leo Guild Wars and today I'm going to talk about the gold speculation of the Bazaar of Four Winds. So I'm just going to talk about how you can probably make a lot of gold. And with the release of the Delphi coverage on the event a day earlier, we get a better understanding on what we're expecting for this event. So currently there will be a new supply box, which is the Zephyr supply box, which will allow you to get a chance of quartz crystals and recipes. Now the quartz crystal is the main thing here because this is going to be turned into charged quartz crystals in turn used to craft new items that are released during this event which are celestial stats so that's every stats boost now i'm going to talk about two things here where you can make the most gold which are the new currency used to get the zephyr supply boxes which are the current materials used for crafting. So an example would be the droop scraps, the wool scrap, uh, thin leather sections, you know, copper ore, etc. You, you get the hint. And with this list provided by Dolphy, you get, you get to see how many of the certain item you need to get the one Zephyr supply box. Now this is where the speculation comes into play. A lot of people will be thinking that these current materials will at least increase 30% at most or even 50%. So that's where you can probably double your investment. and the second thing that where you can make your most money is probably the quartz crystal itself so a lot of people are stacking up these materials in turn to be able to you know convert it into zephyr supply boxes to get the quartz crystals and as you all know the first day of any release in guild wars 2 anything any item related to the event will have a significantly increase of price it's just ridiculously increased for an example the dragon bash when the dragon wings first came out the price was at least probably 50 gold and then in at least five hours or 10 hours it drops to 20 gold so you can see the huge you know difference of gold range so the most gold you'll make is probably the first couple days of the event so quartz crystals you'll make the most money it's not the charge quartz crystals because those are account bound so when you get the quartz crystals sell that asap so just a little recap you're going to make the most gold from the materials such as the currency to make the zephyr supply boxes which are you know the materials for crafting and the second would be the quartz crystal which you get from the zephyr supply box in turn, you have to use the material as currency to get the Zephyr supply box. I hope that's not too confusing, and I hope this kind of enlightened what's to be expected. I know this is probably bad for all the investors out there because I'm, you know, letting most of the gamers know about this method, but I just want you guys to really enjoy the game and make lots of gold, guys. <laughs> Leo Guild Wars, over now.